Paso internet service provider in the borderland suddenly went out of business, leaving their customers confused and angry. As ABC 7's Will Heron reports, the company required customers to pay one year in advance. Tech One customers said they found out through a Facebook message that the company was going out of business and nobody would be receiving refunds. Everyone I spoke with said that you had to pay for a full year of service up front. Some customers only got two weeks of service before they were cut off. You know, I did sign up in late April and I, of course I paid for a, a year of service. And uh, of course I had uh, two weeks of service. I mean, it was good, but then after that, um, we uh, we didn't have any type of service. Mario Tapia, a customer of Tech One Wired, says the service stopped in July. Just posted on Facebook, you know, stating that the reason that uh, no service was actually being offered was because of, there was a shortage of equipment, of course, due to the COVID. He says he paid more than $300 for internet service. To complicate things, the receipt for service states that there are no refunds and your service may be cut off at any time. I stopped by the address where Tech One Wired was. Even the sign is gone. Assistant County Attorney Evi Licona, who prosecutes deceptive business cases, advises Tech One customers who feel they have been scammed to file a police report. My office does take them seriously, and we prosecute them because it's part of our mission is to help people in our community uh, seek justice. And that Sierra says she had service with Tech One for more than three years. She just wants one thing. I, I would just like my money back. An internet search reveals that Tech One Wired is owned by Carlos Salazar. Now, Salazar would not speak on the record to ABC7. Evie Licona said that if a business commits fraud, those responsible for the fraud could spend a year in jail or a maximum of a $4,000 fine. Here in West El Paso, I'm Will Heron, ABC7.